What a way to start a weekend. Early morning Friday, Lawnmower Simulator, the blue collar of action sports. This is an indie game added to the PS catalog and I'm checking it out now. We got a big career mode so I can start my landscaping business. We got a nice sweet challenge mode for when I'm ready for some extra challenge. Uh, to compete against the time limit and uh, have your reputation put your reputation on the line with the uh, see if you cut the mustard cut in the grass turn it on a dime and racing through a challenge course and then of course there's free mo for the hobbyists the weekend warriors who want to sharpen up their hedge and trimming skills on the weekend and then of course there's more to buy. So I think if I'm going to start with anything, I need to get the basics underfoot. Let's start with career mode. Lawnmower Simulator. Landmark Edition. Skip tutorials. We better play with tutorials. I need to learn the basics, the fundamentals. Let's get started. In this mode, you can create your own lawn mowing company, build up its reputation. As you expand your company, you can hire employees purchase more mowers and unlock new contracts and then pretty soon you'll be the big boss run your own uh, independent contract company for the government puts you out of business from a lockdown scandemic uh, but first your company needs setting up a name logo and uniform um, okay how about company name I don't want to confirm I want to adjust so let's see if I can enter the company name how about the dummies how about them um, check mark. Uh, it still says company name with a T, and then it says company logo. Um, we ride the saw blade. I like that. The company logo, it's just a swoosh because there's nothing in it. That's the grass that we grow. I want to be the flower power. Mm, company logo. What's the best one? Probably the mower. You need some, the weeds? Are, are, our logo are the weeds. I kind of just like the basic one. You know? He has a square. Edit player. I think he looks pretty perfect as it is. Player appearance. Customize your in-game appearance of the player avatar and the physical appearance. Blah, 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 blah. What's my name? I think my name is, uh... What's my name? Um, what about... If my name were... Edit player and uh, my player avatar. He looks pretty perfect as it is. I don't like that stupid ass mustache. I like his hat too. And his gloves, logo placement. Where else would you like me to place it? Up his ass. It's on his back too. And the uniform cover, they're perfect too. I just don't know about these gray pants. But I think that's about good enough. Um, company name, company logo, and the player. Let's confirm. Lawn mowing simulator. I'm very, very happy and excited to start my new career with this game. Test drive career mode. Uh, now that you have a company of your own, you'll need your first vehicle to get cutting. Select the vehicle list below and take it for a test drive. Um, I, okay, I read it up. Side discharge. Oh, I needed to read that. It's okay. I already know what I want. Side discharge type deck. Vehicles equipped with side discharge, meaning as you cut with it, grass is discharged to the side in a chunk. In the chute, when cutting with these types of decks, keep in mind the direction you're mowing to avoid, oh, grass piles. I like the bag in the back, dude. It's a little bit heavier. But I don't like that side chute shit. Mulcher type. This vehicle is equipped with mulcher type. I mean, you cut with it. Cuttings are so small, no visible blades are left. Uh, no piles of grass will be left unless you overload the engine. Oh, cool. Maybe you want that. I think that's what my guy uses. And what does this guy use? Test drive. Why don't I just start with the basics and collect them? I like that, though. Well, let's start with the basics. The Stiga. I need to hit triangle to test drive. Let's confirm. I forgot about that, though. The different types of mowers. I think the last one's the best, though. Welcome to the test drive area. Here you can familiarize yourself with a particular vehicle. You can a real contract. Yeah, because this is just like real life. What's my, um, whoa. I'm on foot. Do I have a third person? 
That's right, they said it has on, on foot segments. Can I slide cancel? Um, none of the buttons seem to do anything. R1 runs. R1 runs, that's for damn sure. What about my, uh, my touchpad? Nothing. What about my D-pad? Nothing. All right. All right, there's no crouch. What about my reload button? I like the windmill in the back. Makes me feel like it. Where do you think, where do you think, uh, we are? Where do you think in the United States that we are? Um, I'm tr I'm looking at the, I'm looking at the, the wind. Um, I want to say Tennessee or Kentucky. Let's, it's probably, you know, cause, okay, okay. Uh, we got the windmills. All right, that's an indication. And we got the dewy dawn humidity of the early morning humidity. And then we also have these weeping willows. So we're a little bit, we're a little bit down south to Midwest. I can tell. I think we're going to say that we're in Knoxville, Tennessee. I think that's where we're going to say we are. If I see some old time looking cop cars, I know I'm right. Um, enter the vehicle. Boy, you got to make me get close up to the screen to read these uh, t text for ants. Once you're on your vehicle, you will need to get it started and onto the grass. Each vehicle is slightly different to get going. Follow the stages, steps to get it started at the bottom of the stage screen. Uh, start the engine. Hold square to get the engine started. I'm holding. Hold it! I'm holding. Increase the throttle. Use left and right to change the vehicle setting. I want to go fast. Accelerate. R2 and L2 to brake. All right, I'm riding. I like that in first person mode I'm on foot, but in third person mode I'm on the car. Or vice versa. Drive to the grass. Uh, take a moment to get used to drive over the grass and start cutting. Can I go faster? Wait a minute, this camera's no good. This camera's no good. It's reverse. Alright, the camera's no good. Let me see if I can uh, fix that. The camera's no good. Let me see if I can fix that. No, invert. Uh, look, Y axis. First person on mower, third person on mower. I have first person on mower, but no third person on foot. What? Toggle sprint on mower. Let's see if I say yes and then confirm. Nope, that didn't do anything at all. Do you guys know what the Y axis is? Maybe it did do something. I think it did fix it now. All right, I think it fixed it now. It did, it did. Oh my God. All right, I'm mowing. Get ready to cut the grass. Get ready to cut the grass! Once on the grass, you now need your deck ready by first setting the cut height and then engaging the cutting. I'm not fucking doing any of this. You said you want to cut, it's getting cut. You should only ever turn on the blades when on grass, otherwise you'll damage them and affect their ability to cut. Um, change the cut height. What? Engage, use square to engage and disengage the cutting blades. Where's my cut height? Oh, I see centimeters, centimeters, centimeters. Well, what do we want it? Cut height. When on contracts, you'll be required to cut to a certain height. Jesus fucking Christ. Each contract has its own height. Set the cut height to a range within five to six and cut the grass. Uh, contract progress. While cutting on track for the progress, blah, blah, blah. Let's do it to five and they're engaged. Am I cutting? Yeah, a little bit. And we want to go to that rim. Oh, cause it's in the back. What happens if I bang into the wall? Well, maybe we won't find out. And you don't want to cut the shrubs. You don't want to cut the shrubs. Jesus Christ, 0.8%. And you don't want to cut the shrubs. You didn't really do a good job. Well, we'll get, we have a, a trimmer. We got a clipper trimmer. You're, what the fuck, I'm overloading the engine. If you want to get off the vehicle for any reason, press and hold circle. All right, I think I'm good to go though. You know, like I think I'm good to go. You're overloading the grass. No, I'm not. So, if I want to get even closer to these shrubs, that's what we have a weed whack for. 
I don't like this one in the back, I'll admit. I don't like the one in the back. This is just for amateurs. But you need to learn the basics before you can get onto the... Oh, that's okay, we got a little bumper. You need to learn the basics before you can get onward to the... Uh, whatever else I was going to say. So you think that you want to do it in uh, first person? I'm overloading the engine. No, I'm not. Don't engage the blades unless you're on the grass. Well, now, what's the most proper way to trim this shit? Do you just go around the rim and work inward, or do you go up and down? Uh, Pro View. By holding R3 while stationary, you can engage Pro View, which highlights which areas of the grass have not been cut. All right. Useful for finding the last remaining to complete the contract. All right. This is really fucking boring so far. The idea that so many games are just being used to simulate actual jobs because we have nothing better to do in our lives. Unbelievable, dude. Let's trim up this edge and then we'll go back inside. Oh, you hear you're not on the grass, so... Is there a first person view? How do I switch up? Oh, maybe I'm overloading the engine now. Can I go in reverse? Yes, yeah, sometimes. And so then pretty much I'm just going to have to... Uh, pretty much I'm just going to have to... Uh, repeat the same fucking thing over and over again. Let's try out some more of these buttons. Square disengages the blades. Circle gets up. Uh, what does triangle do? There we go. What the fuck? Oh, I got an I got an overhead view like it's old school GTA, and then I have back far back third person. Oh, first person mode. Now we're cruising. But I gotta admit, I can't see if the grass is getting cut behind me. So first person view is not gonna work. I don't really like this mower, although it is working. It's doing its job. It's doing its job. Let's trim up these. Yeah, perfect. Look at my progress. Oh my god. Hold R3 to see the highlight if I'm pro view. And then you can, uh... You can, uh... I don't know, highlight to see how much the contract is left to be done. This is the tutorial. Hey, this game sucks because it's too repetitive. Like, if this were a job, you'd be pissed. At least you'd listen to some stupid podcast while you're doing it, you know? Oh, yeah, what does he have to say? Oh, yeah? Well, at least I don't have to think for myself listening to all them. I think I'm... I th see, and then you zone out, you get highway amnesia, and you veer off course. This is an embarrassing display. Just lay Oh no, I'm overloading the engine. And then I'm gonna have to empty the bag? This is awful. This is literally a job. Hey, I'm ready to quit. I don't know about you, but I'm ready to quit. Um, finish the progress? Okay. Finish the progress. I don't like this mower, the one that trails behind. I think I'm ready for a more advanced load. A more advanced steed. Yeah, I'm ready to quit. This game sucks. Um, I can't imagine what a challenge mode would be like. Overloading the engine, slow down. How fast am I going? 170 miles an hour? Yeah, we'll trim it all up later. Who cares? I wonder, since this is the tutorial, if I just go like this, if I'll, if I'll do better. Overload the engine. And then what is this up and down? Um, warning, you're cutting the wrong height. Oh, no. I Oh, up and down is a cut height. And then what about revving the engine? It's just left and right to turn it on or off. It's like the ignition. You need to know these things. You need to know these things. No, I fucking don't. It's so stupid. I hate that. Man, don't get me started, okay? All the places that I worked. 
with real human beings. One time I went to the bank and the guys were like beginning to blacktop the uh, asphalt. And it was a Saturday and I was like, hey, I, I don't want to, you know, step over your guys' work, but uh, I need to use the ATM. Would that be cool? And they were like, it says the ATM's closed. I was like, oh, no, the ATM is inside the front door. Like, I can use my bank card to get in get in the door and use the ATM. I just, I don't want to walk over the parking lot if you guys are, you know, redoing the blacktop, you know. I don't want to, and they're like, it says it's closed. That's why the cones are there. You're just going to have to come back. I was like, you know what, okay. Yeah, sure, dude. You know, sorry to bother you. A fucking hour later, they're gone. The fucking whole black dog is fucking slipping like a bowling alley. And I was like, fucking assholes. I just walked over it and went into the fucking ATM. They thought that they fucking moved the ATM from the side of the fucking building on the drive up and that they closed. They're shutting the bank down. Shut up, you fucking moron. Great work in a real contract. Whatever, dude. Whoa, where did I. Did I ghost ride the whip? Uh, cut the engine and hold circle to get off. Get on the vehicle. What about this? Fill fuel, recover. What does recover mean? What does recover mean? Change cutting blades. Sprint. Can I, um... So I don't have a third person... I don't have a third-person view. I don't have a third-person view on foot, but I do... I do on my lawn. What? Look, leave the location. Oh, I gotta turn it on, um... Uh... What? Start engine. Hold to start the engine. And then change the throttle. Contract complete. Alright, contract complete. Uh, do we gotta back it in or can we just pull it in? And then disengage the blades. Oh, the cut of oh, the blades. What do I do? Down? Left, you can throttle it down. I gotcha. And then hold circle to get off. Hold circle to get off, I guess. Leave the location. Okay, that was a successful tutorial. It was a successful tutorial. Um, that was just a test drive. Well, then let's switch. Let's switch vehicles, and we'll start the real career mode. Let's switch vehicles and we'll start the real career mode. I think that I'm ready for the big guns. The off sea night, corn ferry, um, whatever. Uh, purchase it. Oh no, I gotta buy it? Yeah, okay, sure. Let's blow all our money again and then run out of business. We'll run this thing straight into the ground. Uh, the purchase it. Blah, 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 blah. Mower's great for open areas. String trimmers are perfect for lawn edges and cutting red objects. I just said that. I just said that. Um, what's the difference? What's the difference? I like the one where you hold it above. Um, sure. S select the contract in this contract map. Well, there's only one, right? Why don't I just do this one? Uh, you'll see information about its value, except the requirements. Um, 99% cut. Grass rent height, 5 to 6. Recommended cut time, 26 minutes, no fucking way. Completion cut, recommended deck, um, value. Employee vehicle equipment, must assign employee. It'll be me, I guess. And then the vehicle is this, and then the equipment is this. And then, all right, I'm ready to go. Um, start it up. I pretty much got the gist just from doing that other one. I want to ride this other mower, though. 
Um, the cut height is five to six. Ground check phase. What? At the start of contract, you have a small period of time to find or move objects um, that you would not automatically use to sprint. Where am I supposed to be cutting? Not around there. Woo, sweet ride. Got the yellow official. Well, where's my, where's his, um, to move objects. Why don't I move this? Pick up this object. And I got to run around. Pick that up. What is this? I thought it was a chicken. It's the lawn ornament. All right, ground check time. Get on the vehicle. Uh, skip the check. I'm done. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What about over there? Do I have to go through the gate? I'm holding circle to get off. What about this? Leave a location without even doing it. That'd be funny. Do I need to go in here? Uh, I guess not. Completely ignore that location. Get on the vehicle. And then we'll hold the start. And then we'll keep it at a low throttle. Yeah, but I don't want to go that high yet. Got the cut height. Alright, this one's a little bit slippier. See, it's got back wheels. And then we'll, um, how am I going to do it? Career performance, shut up. I'm going to go back to front. And then we're going to engage the blades. Uh... You circle the lower and raise the cutting deck. What? You circle the raise and lower the cutting deck. So that this one cuts in front. I think that's going to be better. You circle the raise and lower the cutting deck. And then, um, I guess you just got to keep holding. It's kind of like a roller coaster. You just got to keep it going. So this one, uh, the cutting deck is in front, and the wheel posts are in the back, and it'll slide a little bit, slip and slide around. I think this is going to be better, but it's going to be tougher to handle. Maybe for you amateurs, you need that side deck. And what's my cut progress time? 99% progress it needs. So you can't miss a blade. Wow, this fucking sucks, dude. Oh my god. Like, I, ad I admire the developers bothering to make this game, but no one would, should want to play this game. You should want... Well, well, you should just want to do something... You should just want to do something else. That's the most polite way that I'll say it. That's the polite way I'll say it. There, I hear there's um, a desperate need for Unity games. Maybe you should go make something like that. just reminding every every blue collar day I ever had installing appliances delivering propane I didn't deliver propane what did I deliver I don't know no I think I did I think I did but to uh, industrial uh, I don't know dude this story's but it's not a story it's just my life Oh, you're getting over encumbered with all this grass. This stinks, dude. I quit play Eternites. Um, what else can I play? What else have I done? I guess I never did landscaping. I did, um, like I said, delivering propane and propane delivery. Um, I guess I did do it to some to some residential homes. It just got some tank. This is not a real story. It's just my real life. It's like a documentary. Um, what the hell else? I don't know. There's there's really nothing here. I admired that the game's um, modeling and animations are so good. But, like, why would you want to drive around? Man, there are people that are complaining online about the Crew Motor Fest. And it's like, do you have any idea how bad games can get? I'll say that the modeling looks amazing. 
and the handling is also amazing. But this is not a game. This is literally a job. Remember when I played that mail delivery simulator, Lake? And, like, it's the most sincere, uh, independent story that's ever been written or voice acted or scripted in a game. But it's the worst, like, crazy taxi style mini game delivery that you've ever seen. And that's this. Like, that's this game. This is not a game. This is an arbitrary virtual task that does not need to be done. And the experience is attempting to complete the task and get it done. It, it, it's not, you know, fighting a boss and or experiencing a story or a scripted event and having any type of experience at all. It's, it's the chore. It's the chore. It's the activity. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to polish this off and I'm going to finish this one around. We're gonna polish this off around around here. So I have to keep coming back here. They say it's gonna take 20 and 26 minutes. And then you're missing all these little scraps. You're missing all these little scraps you have to find. And then you'll use your um you'll use your lawnmower vision to find it. Oh boy. Here, look, we'll trim around here. We'll trim around here. So you really make sure to get around here. Trim, trim height is... And this is why you want to go around, because you can't turn so much. Yeah, I think this is an advanced lawnmower, but you know what? I don't like that, um... I don't like that yellow one. I like this one having it cutting in the front and not the back. Ground damage? You've managed to damage the ground and destroy some grass? Hey, fuck you, dude. No, I haven't. You're lying. What, I was like doing burnouts in the grass? Oh well. Oops. Oops. Maybe you should just reverse it then. Oh, and see this reverse because, see, look, this cart, this cart has double wheels. So this reverse. This reverse is not a simple reverse. It's like a trailer hitch. You want to you want to turn the wheel the way you want to go, not opposite the way you want to go. Look, see, you didn't do it right, you stupid blue collar shithead. You didn't do it right. Too stupid even to figure out how to mow somebody's lawn. Penalty: you damage the grounds. Fine incurred. You know what? I guess I'm just not cut out for this type of thing. I guess I'm just not cut out for this type of thing. Jeez. The fury that I have attempting to complete some arbitrary task. Like I think I'm too good. Motor overload? Shut up. Just... My time, my time is better spent doing something else than grinding out. Oh, it's in, it's infuriating. I don't know why. It's just like a simple task that needs to be done. It should be the easiest job in the world, and yet it's infuriating. It's like it's almost. I'm not a detail-oriented person, but this is almost the absence of detail. Also infuriates me. <laughs> really, really, the attitude is I want to do something smarter, and they're like, well, if you can't even figure out how to do the stupidest task, how smart can you really be? Warning, you're overloading the engine. Shut up. Let's see if we can finish this contract. I'm already 7% done. They said it was going to take 26 minutes. What is this fucking overload the engine? 
Maybe the bag is full, dude. Maybe the bag is full. I have to get it 99% complete. And then maybe, um... Maybe, um... Well, I don't know, maybe. Here, let's trim these hedges back. Uh-oh, damage the ground. Who gives a shit? Yeah, finish this up. Oh, missed the spot, missed the spot. Who cares? Oh, you can use your special vision to see, uh... What spot you missed? No, you didn't do it right. You didn't do it right. No, you didn't do it right. <laughs> I thought you said you were supposed to be smart. You're supposed to learn how to do this really important thing. All right, I quit. That's how. That's how it goes. That's how it goes. If you do it this way, you do it wrong. And it's like, do what wrong? You'll cut the grass. I thought we were supposed to cut the grass. No, you'll damage it. Who cares? They don't want it. They don't want what? The fucking dirt in their yard? They don't want the dirt in their yard. They'll cut the wrong way. Who cares? The stupid shit you fucking concern yourself with. Do it like this. No, you didn't do it right. No. Well, then why don't you fucking do it if it's so important? You see how pissed I get? Why don't you do it if it's so fucking important? Oh, because it's not important. Because that's why they don't pay you. They're laughing at you. They think you're a laughing stock. I'm going to fuck this person's whole lawn up and they're never going to hire me again. Well, good. I don't want to do this job anyway. I quit. You have a bad attitude. What's good about it? What's good about it? It's really important. An arbitrary blue-collar task that requires no thought whatsoever but immense precision. And if you step even an iota out of the detail-oriented bounds, people will become so irate because their brains, their blue-collar brains, can't comprehend. Well, if you're so smart with your glasses and your four eyes, you know, Riddle, riddle me this point, Dexter. No new contracts, minus all the expenses of the equipment. How, uh, how, how, how much money do you make, or should I say lose, when you, you have to shut your business down? That's right, we shut our business down, and these people can go mow their own fucking lawn instead of demanding that I do it. Son of a bitch customers. Up, took out a few plants. What if I just take revenge on all this entire, this entire lawn? I'll just ruin the whole thing. I'll ruin the whole thing. They're not going to be very happy with me. Can I lower the, um, oh, you, I, I did start the engine. All I did was lower the, uh, oh, it has to be, so the engine's got to be started and, the engine has to be started and, how do I, uh, oh, raise it up. And then that prevents me from damaging the grass. That's so smart. Who are the geniuses who made this equipment? They're real geniuses. Penalty, you damage the ground. I thought that I fucking pressed it and it was up. You damage the ground. Cut height. Oh, the cut heights. That's why the cut height got all fucked up. Hey, my cut height's all fucked up now. Not engaged. Oh, fuck. Not engaged. We're really gonna burn this thing. So every time you, um... Oh, I have the weed whacker, too. Fuck that, I'll use this. Watch, I'm an expert. And then it's not engaged, that's why. You pull it up and it's not engaged. 
All right, so you pull it up. Ah, you don't engage with it. I gotcha. I gotcha. See, I need to learn the ropes. But then you're driving around this lawn. I think that looks pretty good. Now, what do you do? Um, you hold R3. Around the edge. It's around the edge. All right. It's around the edge. I gotta finish a shit contract. You gotta be standing still. I got some. Maybe I should use the weed whacker and just walk around with it. Oops, hit the plant, hit the plant. Can you stand still? Look, it's all around the edge. Maybe I should get the weed whack. Let's pull this up. We'll finish it up with the weed whack. God, this game's fucking awful. I'm quitting. It's infuriating me, dude. It's literally the exact same thing as the real fucking job, and it's just as infuriating. Just some detail-oriented cunt task that makes me want to um, go do something else, I guess I'll say. Give me this. Use the trimmer. Uh, place trimmer... What? Place trimmer string? No, I have it. Hold to start cutting. I need to... S Why don't you fucking... Does that do it? A little bit? I gotta clean up all the spots that I miss. Which is like basically everything around here. Could you imagine if you did this for real? And made money? Instead of in a fucking video game? Oh my god. I think I got back there. Let's put my uh, Ray-Bans on and use my visor and then I'll see where I fucking miss. All that? What? It's like a... What do you mean pick up grass? Pick up grass. I am picking it up. Pick up grass. Press and hold. Press and hold. Oh, because, um, I don't have a bag on me. Because I don't have a bag on me. Oh. What if I look up? It doesn't count. God, I would hate doing... I'm, I'm all... I quit. I quit. Uh, one one contract on the entire fucking job, and that's enough. I would never do this in my real life. I'd take this weed whacker to my forehead, dude. Oh my god. How could... It's just... I, I can't... I, there's just nothing to think about. There's nothing to think about other than just doing this fucking task. And it's so detail-oriented. It it's, it's, it's horrific. It's the most horrific thing I've ever experienced in my life. And I was in Guantanamo. It's still not done yet. It needs to be 99%. Let's just find some. Just cut their plants. Just take revenge. And then pick it up. Let's trim around these hedges and then we'll see if we can we'll see if we can get it. Alright, cutting cutting mode complete. Let's fucking get the hell out of here, dude. Destroy the flower. Oh yeah? Well fucking here's one more. Fucking ass. Leave the location. Let's let's just escape and get out while we still can. 
Leave the location. Fuck that, dude. It was horrific. I have almost like... I have almost like... PTSD. Um, Post-traumatic stress. Um, ground check failed. Which, dude. And it cost total... What did I even earn? Or did it cost me? I had to... Um, I had to buy this mower. So this one contract, at least continue the mower. Uh, this is the vehicle garage. You could damage and fix stuff. Oh, you got to maintain the vehicle? Um, oh, God. What? Shop's available. Um, what about it? Maintenance. Vehicle maintenance. What about repair? Engine? Uh, nothing's wrong with it. I just need new fuel. Uh, yeah, it's fine. 98. What about fuel? We're good. Refuel. Is that worth it? Fuel refuel. Uh, is not full. Select how much you'd like to fill. I guess you should always refuel it. Um, uh, let's see. Have I lost everything in the area or King's value? I'll tell you what. Um, I almost want to just ride in here and destroy it, but I know it's wrong. I've learned how to respect I've learned how to respect people's property values. Um I can't do this. And I need to quit. So I'm not giving my two weeks. I'm giving my two minutes. This was one of the most traumatic video game simulation experiences I've ever had in life. And I think I'm going to need to take the next two years off. Lawn mowing simulator.